Jamal Nyes here with Leron Murphy after a first round TKO. You didn't seem too happy with the way that one went though. Can you explain what happened, why the fight was stopped? Because from where I was standing, I didn't, I didn't see it. So I hit him with a side kick, um, standing, knocked him down. Hit him with a body shot on the ground and he just quit. But to me, it looked like he wanted an easy way out. But maybe it hurt him, maybe it didn't. I just wanted a fight, so that's why I was disappointed. You know, as, a, as, as a fighter, I can imagine you put your all into training camp and you want to get tested. Um, yeah, it must be it must be one of the most annoying things on the planet. Yeah, but um, it's one of them. My opponent dropped out five days ago, so he's a late replacement. So it's one of them. So what what more can you ask for? You're four and zero now. Um, what's your plans next? So you've got to be thinking after a, a victory that's gone like that. You've got to be thinking about what's next, and you want to get back in the cage as soon as possible. Yeah, of course. Um, I had a hard training camp. I felt like I overtrained, so when I got in there, I felt a bit flat. Um, but I'm going to have a week out and hopefully get back in there as soon as possible. I'm going to go down to featherweight. Um, I want to fight, so that's it. I just want to fight. Is there anyone in particular that you are looking at? I don't call people out. I don't call people out. It's, if whoever the matchmaker gives me, we'll fight. And in terms of the promotion that you're looking at, could it be another one under FCC? or? I think FCC will be next year, and I want to fight again this year. Well, uh, it was really impressive up until the fight was stopped, um, and, I, and I enjoyed it, so I'm looking forward to seeing you back in the cage. Thank you. Cheers, man. Thank you.